the Aether Lens first. A lot of the time, you just get double value out of the uh, Arcane Boots. Who have they found? And look at Rich's Siamese Cat. Solo kill for Toronto, Tokyo. Should be able to... Oh, he's not even going to be able to find it. All right, up to top now. Stopping we go point. by the outpost. A jump in. On to collapse, but Mira with the blink reveal as well. They're decent avalanche to be able to prevent the follow-up. It looks like they'll just sacrifice Mira's life. But it's still really vital, right? Remember what it can get rid of. It can get rid of the slows. It can get rid of the roots. It means that you are scared of this troll warlord, but maybe not as much as you used to be. Run the first go. Not the spiders. The mirror wants the gold. No, the double stun. And they're going to be able to jump instantly to follow up. Great. Front to Tokyo with the blink out to the left side. Here is in a position as well to try and jump in if he finds an opening. But Ash, they're going to back off of his team. Roche is still relatively scary. low. Let's see if they want to try and clean this. It's a scary fight for Dio. Yeah, but they have no vision right now on Spirit, so it's going to need to be a ballsy dive by Collapse. They need to time it perfectly. Collapse is going to attempt it, but it'll be too late. Mira still gets an incredible avalanche with a fall as well. They're all grouped up on Asta. But they haven't died just yet. Money. Torrents with the BKB, he's gonna be okay, along with Ori, thanks to the Bloodstone, but they want to try and call the retreat. But Monet will just TP out directly in their face, but unfortunately for Ori, he will not have the same fate. And now it's time for Spirit to clean up. They'll be able to chase down XXS to the south, Collapse will find a freebie. Under the back, over to the left track, they go, but you're oh. Oh. oh no, can they even kill Ori? They might not be able to. Mira's stuck on the high ground. Now he's finally going to be able to jump down to help out as well. The damage has been dealt. They don't have an answer to the last track, especially with the Shadow Demon. Yatoro is positioned, and this will now come down to kind of the support itemization to protect him. His collapse, he found the opening. He's onto the Shadow Demon. Wraith back will help mitigate a lot of the damage for the rest of Team Spirit nearby. A call up to three. Yatoro will look to enter as well. Now with the battle trends, not the plan. Damage onto Ori at the moment. It looks like Astro is going to be okay to turn this one back around. Up to the northern side, though, Yatoro finally able to deal with XXS. Bonus Widow stops him in his tracks, and they don't have the damage. Look at him dead. Left, right, and center as XXS stays alive, and now it can get the position. Renate's a little bit low for the moment. Again, look at Siamese Cat as well, always playing far away from his team, making sure there's no opportunity for him to be caught out. Poking though, 10 seconds left on Collapse being able to come back. So frequently able to use these illusory ops with the options going. Going to be able to get the ages and now Spirit, they, got, they have to get out. Mira, oh, just a couple of seconds shy of being able to find the blink because Asta, they got to bring down. Spirit need two wins. They need a 2 0 here. It's a guarantee. 1 1 one is still possible. There's Tybrink to look at what could happen. From what on the lane, it's a Pavoka's going to jump inside the base. Trying to bring down some of the supports. Won't have to follow up at the moment. And Mira, they then. might have an opening now. Oh, they don't get the toss to break the coil. Hex is on Toronto Tokyo. It's that close, man. Uh, this is, okay. This is a decent spot now for Spirit. They've got a lane shoved out and they see Ori away from the team. Mm -hmm. a, a Siamese cat as well. That's priority number one. They've got a sentry nearby as well. The McCabe's not gonna really help it out too much, but the Banish will pull hold the back for the moment. They can control Yutoro dealing with the static link, but look at the damage coming through with the battle trends. Yutoro's gonna try and stand toe to toe, but when it's now. So he up the right clicks, the hex fall through, and they just rip apart the troll. As soon as Ori shows up, Spirit need to split away. They need to cut their losses. There's that that river, they might not be so fortunate as Collapse. We'll get some distance thanks to the avalanche. On slot back up shortly as well. But the split earth timing from Ori is on point. No escape for the dino. Collapse, a slow and painful death. They'll make him work for it in the end. But Ori be. I'll keep saying it. No team has won TI starting the lower bracket. It is so goddamn important to have that second life. Imagine starting World Bracket where you have to go through a best of one and then six other series afterwards. My only question is, who do you give the axe to? Because there are so many good players to be able to give it through to. Monet looks like he's going to be the main priority. Just more of that passage damage coming through. Would have been great for Ori with the Nihilism. Would have been great for Siamese Cat as well, just to be able to get three cleansers off. Look at the read from either side. This is beautiful. Spirit have control, but Asta recognizes that they're going to smoke to the middle. They're in the middle. He jumps. Instant use of the BKB, but they're going to try and get the damage out. Yet Tori doing a lot at the moment, but Mr. Kone soaks away with the static link. There's just nothing they can do with Team 
Goes for it once again on full retreat, but they will not escape as Astor surround them and bring them down. The finishing blow as Spirit have to tap out and win this game a loss for them. They will be moved.